Hello and welcome back. Right, start your engines. That's them to go it. Oh, hang on a minute. Are you doing a custom field? I don't want to do that. I just want you to go. Right. <laughs> That's more like it. I thought, yeah, that was a bit strange. Right, so we're doing that. We have, ah, uh, yeah, we do. We've got this one to do straight after. That is true. Yeah, I'm liking this. We are, yes, we are not all grass anymore. Yeah. Right, there's not much we can do presently because we've got literally got everything in use. I've just had a quick, yeah, hold to the poker. Oh, no, no, we are working. Time's one. Definitely. No breaking the rules. Yes, now then, grass. Yeah, not. It's second growth stage. Tomorrow is the last day. Oh, but if we cut tomorrow, the only bad thing is next year it will literally be bold because we'll be cutting on the. Oh no, actually. It still grows in November, doesn't it? I'm sure that's right. Because a growth stage for grass in November. Yeah, you can harvest it whenever, but it stops growing in November. That's right. So if we cut it on October, it will have one growth stage. But if I remember rightly, it dies back one stage. I'm sure that's right. I might be wrong. This is me. Right. Remind me, what do I need to do? Ah, it looks to me like I've left myself some breadcrumbs. Yes. So, let's crack on. Yeah, I'm not going to... Uh, this is a 1.6 update, so I was quite nicely surprised that the game actually loaded without any kind of uh, errors. Yep. Yeah. can't remember if you need to have the engine running without being on. I don't think you do. Yeah. Right, okay. So, I think we can do two at a time. Oh, no. I meant to do that. I'm sure we can do two at a time. That's about right. Let's put them in. Whoa, ho, ho. <laughs> Do you know, I had to get out of the way early, didn't I? I just had to. Yeah, of course I did. Right, I need to roll as well. That is something that we definitely needs doing. So, what we do need is... I'm trying to think, actually, yeah, we could use... Oh, do you know? I do need to have that up. There you go, you see. spikes either. Yeah, pretty lethal. Okay, now we can time lapse this. No, it's not enough is there to time lapse this, it's only a few. If it was a pile of fifteen or something silly. Yeah, I've been looking forward to doing this. I'm a bit tired, I've got to be honest. I'm probably not going to be my A game. But, you know, you've still got to have a day in the office. You can't just decide, right, that's it. I am not going to do anything today. You've just got to get cracking sometimes. But, yeah, I, I apologise in advance because you never are, yeah, when you're a bit tired. you never like your normal self. Yeah, not the life and soul of the party type thing. Not that I'm sure I ever am, but I try my best. I try not to moan too much as well, yeah. I think the days when I moan are the, usually the days when you're a bit tired, so I'll try my best not to giant smash. Right. Yeah, so it's yeah a bit more stability than the last update, that's where all of the... Uh, <laughs> He says, he says, let's not, let's not giant bash. No, no, I'm not... 
I'm not going to dissolve into um, badness about giants. Yeah, I'm just just saying the truth. That like, the last update was a tad. Yeah, it was a bit horrible. Once, if you remember it, all of the script-based mods went. Or was that the one before? I do lose. Yeah, that was the worst in my opinion of things that had ever gone wrong. That was quite terrible. Yeah, it was shocking. Um, yeah, none of us, of course, knew what was happening until the next day. Yeah, we have got a cracking community with news and all the rest of it. It was amazing. Can I get three in? Sure. I don't think so. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, sort of can, but sort of not. Right, so let's stick this lot back down now. That's done its job. That's the straw done. And let's put this down. Let's put the those away. Yeah. I'm glad we've got the Roberts. It does a cracking job. And also we can do feed food mix all those important animals. Oh. Never do that right, always yeah, right. Smashing. Okay, that's all of that done. Now who's going to do I'm gonna use this one because with only having the rollers are quite fine with this. I'm not sure have I got Right, let's set a course, because I'm almost sure we haven't got a course for this particular one. Right, create job. Field, that one. Generate three headlands. It is a big field. I could probably manage that nicely. Indeed, and save. Field, oh, can I remember? Can I remember this is... 68 I think yeah that makes sense it is because it's got the twos yeah 68 save activate and 12.3 meters I thought it was 12.5 yeah course play is usually good right we are going to deactivate first waypoint and go should not need the gate shut, it should get past that, because yeah, we did do that quite well, I thought. We are going to need to weed that. I did say there were weeds, yeah, needs rolling, weeds growing, so we can preemptively weed that. Okay, I have I got a weed, a mechanical weed, right? I think I have. Still, it'll do our precision farming score well if we do this anyway so let's do it now that oh, yeah ah that's right just gonna test my theory I cannot fill this from the field trigger. Let's see if I'm right or whether it was just an aberration caused by updates. So we could not do this from the field trigger last time. Ah, well this time we can. It was, it was obviously scripts and stuff like that. Smash it, jobs are good and right. I do love this, this is my favourite trailed one. Um, I say that about the bird's head as well. Yeah, I suppose the bird's head is my favourite of those that were in the game. Whereas this is my absolute favourite. Yeah, that came later. So, yeah, I'm not sort of lying, but that is... 
Yeah, I sort of am in a way, I suppose, because I do like the bit. Uh, this was my favourite in FS19. It is bigger as well. I can't remember if we actually had the extensions on this. Just check that I am right. It's 68. And yes, it was 68. Fantastic. We want to create job. Yeah, it's got the right one. And we want to. Oh, oh, that's right. I do remember. Yeah, I didn't actually do it. I think it would be two. Yeah, not bad guess. Yeah, you still sometimes do it, Mr. Smith. You can sometimes get it right. And so we want 32 meters. First, go. Smash it. Hope they don't get poked. Whoa. Oh, you're going to catch that straight away? Oh no. That is a point. Let's have a look at our precision farming scores. Well, we've actually got. That's 71. Oh, overall is 71. Yeah, you can only look at the overall, can't you? That's not bad. We were 50 odds, so yeah, we're not doing badly. Right, where is the roller? Right, are you going to get caught by the... how are they doing across the road? Someone's left a gate open. No message. Messaging system still broken. Yeah. I'm going to try a fresh install though. Yeah, in case it is my game, but I, I can't see it being, if I'm honest. We shall see. It's yeah, it is possible it's mine. Just because it does an update doesn't mean that all of the files are right. Even though I've done the file checking where you do that to check that your files are okay, and it says it is okay. I think sometimes the only way to know it is either you or it's giants is to do a fresh install so I might well do that over the weekends coming weekend I think right so then remind myself what have we yeah because I'm not sure if I left some things up at the get the a gate up at the shop no that looks good to me By myself, did I? How much? Yeah, any digestate left? We're going to leave till the back end because you do get an awful lot more money. Yeah, that's still full. Smash it, that's all good. Has that got any in? Can't say, ooh, we're against the clock. When is it going to rain? When is it going to rain? 10 o'clock. Ooh. Yeah, which you've got to give it up to an hour before, and they do look very much like rain clouds. So, yeah, what time are they going to rain till? Uh oh, according to that. But yeah, you've got to give it an hour either way, really. It could be up to dinner time, so. Let's have a look at the weeds on the uh, overview screen. Right, yeah, yeah. We're going to plant grass as well. In, I think I'm going to do that manually. Although, yeah, we can do. Yeah, the rolling's doing well. Ah, it would have showed green. Obviously, yeah, it's the these. Oh, then let's keep an eye on the roller. So far, they're doing okay because they're on the opposite side of the field. It's if they crisscross. Yeah. There is very little I can do, to be honest. There truly is. We can't uh, can't mow. Let's just go and check the animals. We could at least you know, make sure everything's good. Now, I think it is. I'm sure last time we came to do this, but we will check. 5,000 milk. Health. T yeah, of course. It actually, it's health's not very good. They'll all be the same. We did them all on the same day. Yes, it is. 
That is definitely good. Right, okay. Let's try it. Let's just try that again. I don't know. This takes me back to my very, very first content. Yeah, on that I ran around everywhere. I did. I didn't have a uh, travel with vehicles I used to run. <laughs> it's written. Oh, okay. You finish, finished. Yeah, we'll just finish these little bits that you can see that we've missed it. Yeah, these little. some more actually I can see you well oh, unless they could be that one finishing they could be actually that is a point we'll just go and see if there's any more of the little roundy bits in the corners because they are likely to be ones that we do definitely need to do I think actually these are. I'm sure he's about to finish. Oh, we'll miss some stones there. Oh well, could be worse. actually going to do that. Right, I don't think we need two in here. We'll grab the other one in a minute and we'll stick this one in. I think I might need a crash counter as well. I think, uh, I, yeah, I do seem to be decidedly good at crashing every single session. Right, we are in field 72. Do we have a course for six meters? We do indeed. Clear, load, activate, and go. Smash it. Now, who was that? Who was that has finished? You. Excellent. So I'm all preemptively done. Sure. Right, so are we gonna do the yeah we are. We may as well Mind you. Never assume sometimes the weeds you crush them and they don't appear. It's weird. Some you've got to really pay attention to the fields because I must in admit in FS22 weeds are not yeah they're not trustworthy yet they don't always appear sometimes they do and sometimes they don't yeah it needs rolling that doesn't mean it won't go weeding later right how we do it in this field oh we are doing swimmingly for some reason this is Ah, now that is my fault. Yeah, that's the uh, front box, isn't it? I'm going to need to, yeah. Let's just whiz around the... Uh it's not really expecting that a box on the front, is it, for the turning circle? So that is literally me. If we do this first, I'll switch those off. I know it annoys everybody. <laughs> That's three. 
That's three. Right, okay. Let's try that. We should now. We should. Uh, be about there, I think. Hopefully, that is okay. It's only a little tiny bit here, but then I might well have just fixed all the bits that you were going to do, so. Yes, I am I'm keeping the forge trip for now. But going forwards, when I've got no more Let's Plays with the forge trip on, or when I, I am not going to use that anymore, because it's very confusing with the diagrams of the add-on front three-point link. Now, it's the only tractor that I have found that does do this. Yeah, hence the fact. It's a shame because I do like it. It's a very reasonably priced, good tractor. It looks a bit weird. It's got a very long nose, but apart from that, it's good. But yeah, it's it's this showing. Yeah, showing the, the diagram in the wrong place. It really is very strange. Yeah. See, that's the real front and it's at the back. I don't understand why the diagram on this particular one always shows that. But how is this one doing? Let's have a quick look. Seems to be okay. Right, we are. We will time slot this next because, yeah, it's. I am my. I am gonna. Oh, that's important. Shall we manually do it? Shall we set. No. We will do it. Right on grass. There we go. Yeah, it's going to be. Uh, I suppose we could. Yeah, because it is going to detect that now. We could do a new course. Fields. 71, isn't it? Now that we do need to grab that out of the way, though. Drag you out. TMR. Let's all stick this in the silo. Waste not, want not, and all that. get a new course set for over there because yeah we're going to be juggling we're, most of the tractors are going to be ready so this would be nice just to plod this on I'm not sure whether this is good at, yeah that's true I think what we'll do is we're going to manually do the first round just like we did across the road because I have no doubt that we're going to clock yeah at the edges of the field although is there anything to clock thinking about it that is true let's see going to do this ourselves because really this is going to become the yard I did say that so do you know something we are going to do this ourselves it's still fairly big though but yeah right I'm going to say my words so this is going to still take a few minutes I'm going to see you guys and gals on the other side
I think that's it. Just got to check the lime in and fertilise, and I'm not sure about that. Yeah, that's the only bit I am a little unsure of. We're going to grab the implements out for today, but we will. The other thing is, the important thing is as well, is, yeah, it's choosing a shed. Now, I don't want to use a shed load of money, but I do, yeah, I'm normally good to go for my absolute favourite, my black sheep module one, because it would suit that down to the ground, but it doesn't always do to just do exactly the same thing every single time. Now that's looking good. Let's look on the fields info and see how we appear. So pH is looking good on all of the grass fields, but not looking good, so we haven't, no, oh, doesn't look like we've oh no we did that's why you've got that dark blue i'm not sure we did 71 and 72 though no we won't have done well because obviously we would have waited until we'd have actually put the seeds in nitrogen likewise yeah that is true right 68 that probably has been done it will be but we will check shall no i am <laughs> i am checking well no no it is it's definitely true nitrogen okay so no it does need nitrogen in right so we're going to start by liming now then who should we use I think we should use my yes I do think we're going to use the uh, New Holland I do we need to bring it back across anyway yep yeah. he says as it goes to the RX-170 that's more like it That that's definitely the New Holland Right now, then weeds in. Let's just check. No, we're good for weeding for now. I didn't say it on anything actually, so yeah, I think that is actually okay. Right, so we don't need you. You have fulfilled your purpose. Excellent, we have actually used you. That is amazing. Right, so now we need whichever's in, we'll use that first, whether it is nitrogen or lime. We shall use that. I did see you. What have you got in? You have fertilizer and are you lime in the front? I would imagine it's lime. Can't imagine we're doing fertilizer in the front. Yeah, I didn't think so. Right, we're going to manually do this. It's only going to take a couple of minutes. And now I'm going to chatter. Yeah. It's just been a good, well productive session now that Owen Auto we are indeed. Aha. That is definitely making a difference. That is definitely doing a darker green. Smash it. Right, yes. It's, we have got everything in. We've done the grass in the cow field, which is also going to be the. Uh, I'm not sure how to handle that. The fences. In real life, you would obviously put fences in. You would, but in farming simulator, it's not always that simple. We shall see if we can put one slightly wider and a maybe a gate. But it's then going to restrict. Yeah, it is going to limit the field somewhat. So I think we'll treat it as we just have to make sure the gates are shut on the outside and it is an open pasture. Although, if it was an open pasture, you wouldn't use it for. Um, yeah, I think we're going to have to treat this properly. If we're going to do that, we're going to have to limit the field and stick a fence and a gate in, I think. Yeah, I do. I think that's probably the most realistic approach to that. And also we need to be picking some um, sheds. Yeah, not to stick to the same ones, even though I do love my black sheep mudding ones. That is always... Ah, now this seems to be quite happy with this. So this must be set right. That must be field type. Ah, uh, silty clay. Oh, no, not not all of it. Okay. Oh well, we'll just scatter over the whole field. It's not going to waste any, is it? That's the one good thing about precision farming. It'll only use what it needs. 
that bit at the bottom there, that was okay. Yeah, it was, that is true. Let's see this side. Right, okay. Don't need any there. But you do need some there. Okay. Can cope with that. Let's just go down the middle strip just to make sure. Then we'll go across the road, do the grass fields. We'll do all of the nitrogen, then we'll literally, yeah, do do the rest of the liming. It really does only take about five, ten minutes to do the entire with this fantastic spread. It's amazing. This is the biggest field as well, so yeah, as I'm sure we're all aware. Yes, it's nice to have that money on hand. We've got, yeah, we've got quite a lot of silage to put in over the winter time. So we should get quite a lot of digestate and that all the way over the winter. Next session I'm hoping to whiz us through the winter, is what I'm hoping for. Now we've done all the grass fields, we did those last time, so we need to be going into 71. Which, if I remember rightly, I probably completely left the gate open. Now then, let's zoom in for a minute, even if we're zooming out again. Yeah, let's shut that gate. We've got to get into the habits. We've got animals over there. Yeah, although, to be honest, I would have a fence. I wish it'd let me do a fence where I wanted it to. But yeah, can't have it too narrow. It's going to make it so awkward for getting in and out. If we have it too big, it's going to lose us a lot of the field, but it is what it is. We are on auto, we are indeed. Yeah, it doesn't do the. It does not do the. I've got to get used to this. It does not do the green that it used to do anymore for grass. Yeah, it's this weird orange colour. It is strange when people change the rules on you. You know, how your brain tells you that's not right. Yeah, it is. It is true, this used to go a beautiful green colour, now it's orange. Just goes so against the grain, if you'll forgive the pun. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not worried about rolling the little bits around the side, it's more for looks, aesthetics, because obviously, yeah, we are. Now then, let's, let's try not to flick fertiliser in the, in the fields. Let's try and get this... Uh, yeah, we wouldn't want the cows eating fertiliser now, would we? You would be careful though, wouldn't you, really, with this type of thing, if it was real, real. In fact, let's there you go, I even stop the cast. Right. We do need to shoot this straight past us. Yeah, I think we will. I think what we'll do is we'll put a fence quite a goodly way out, even if we lose some of the field, I would like to make it realistic. We'll do that another session though, I think, for now. Yeah, I want to just get all these little the uh, little jobs and all the farm work done this session so that we can whiz through the winter in the next session. I did I did think this would be a small session, but it has ended up being quite a long one. There was a lot more work than I sort of anticipated in my head. Yeah, I thought this was be much more, yeah, much less. Right. Yeah, obviously didn't. No, it's definitely going a different colour, so if I did, it certainly... I didn't do it with auto, or they've changed the rules with the new update. It could be either of those, really. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, I do know we need to do that other field, the little field. And we've got all of the field work done though, everything's planted, that is a good place to be. There's a couple of big patches of stone, but not much, there really isn't the air. There's one I saw in 71, a big stones, there were lots of little stones which we rolled in. On this one, I thought we did Funkasu this one, if you remember, we did actually get that or bought. It didn't, yeah, I missed a couple of stones. There's one patch in that corner there. So, but I, I can live with that. It's not the end of the world. We did the job. We're not perfect. 
Right, this little triangle. Yeah. Of course, yeah, that patch, entire patch is the bad patch of this field. That's a uh, top one. This is the best soil we've got here. Yeah, loam. And did I? No, I didn't. Do you know? Yeah, there's a few. Yeah, they're the turnaround spots with the when it got de-stoned. You can see. I thought. I, oh, obviously, I didn't. No, I must have missed that. That's, it is what it is. It's not the end of the world. Yeah, there's. It's not like the snowstones in any other fields. And it's. It. We did try. We didn't just ignore them or anything like that. Yes. There's some fantastic new ploughs in the game. Absolute monsters. A 22 and a 26 meter. Not really meant for a map like this. Yeah, I don't know how you'd get them onto the field, if I'm honest. Right, do we need fuel? No, we're surprisingly good. Right, I think, yeah, that, that is true, actually. That's not going to hurt. We are going to. Now we've got this field here, we're going to eject this on the side. Let's just try and nudge that one that's a little bit out down. Not, not that they always like to be nudged, I might add. Right, we want lime in this. Do the liming over here. Now, is this in a better position than the one across the road? It is, yeah, it's not bad. That is better. I've got to angle my nozzles. I could actually replace someone across the road. It's not bad in the corner. It's that I placed it a bit badly. I think I need to do my nozzles either to the left or the right if I'm going to do that. Now, that's in the middle, so I'm surprised that is as good as it is. But line. No, I could do with the front box, but hey-ho. Ah. Okay. Then we did line. Did we lime in that field? Yeah, perfect. Let's see. I'm not sure. I don't think so. It doesn't look the same, does it? The green's different. Let's have a go. Yay. Smashing. Is it auto? It is indeed. We do this in one. It's not bad though, it really isn't. It's only a touch up this definitely. You can see by the green it still was quite green. So it shouldn't kill us for the lime this time. Not like when you're doing it the first time and it really absolutely tears the lime. You get through tons and tons. I know in FS19 you used to get through a field this size, probably about 10, 11 tons on the first thing. On the bigger fields you'd sometimes get through twenty something tons of lime, which is I would imagine I suppose on a big field that's probably right. Right. Let's go over the road. We shall see how the liming I don't mind leaving the gate open on this one. Right. Yeah. Let's have a look at this one. Whoa, be careful. Oh, ah no, pH good, not perfect. So let's let's change that to good, good. Yeah, if a job's worth doing. It's worth doing well, as the old but very good saying goes. Just because it's an old saying doesn't mean it's a bad one. Yeah, there were a lot of old wise, yeah, old wise sayings, old wise people as well. It's yeah, not I know obviously some things have been disproved unscientifically, but there's still an awful lot of old wise tales that were had a, a certain amount of credibility and a certain amount of truth. Right, let's yeah, let's do this. The 
minimum effect into the cat field. Let's do the cast on the way out. Yeah, that's not bad. Not a bad effort. Right, last bit, I think. I'm sure I did that one last time when we actually did it. The big field I'm talking about. Yeah, I'm sure we just saw that on the edge. I can't remember that. Let's have a look. Let's be thorough. Yeah, we did. I saw the lime just thinking about it. Yes, my short term memory is working today. Yeah, I remember the, yeah, the, seeing the lime. That is true. So, we should be now. That's nitrogen. Yeah, 71 is orange now, that's what throws me out. And we want pH, yeah, we've over-limed 68. That blue is because, yeah, it's at 8. <laughs> so we've gone a bit mad with the lime. If you remember, I just did it too heavily. So everywhere else, it's exactly where it should be. That's amazing. Smashing. So that is all field work done. Shall we? What did? What is on special offer? Ah, the little Zeta, I do remember. I also remember that we said, even on this Let's Play, that we do need... Yeah, it really is big, isn't it? No, I'm trying to grab the rocket. Torpedo! Would you stop saying rockets? Oh, my life. There, you're the one I want. Yeah, the original one. The original tractor that started us all off. How could I possibly forget? Yeah. Right, let's just check this. What we're going to do is we're going to speed the day up a little bit and yeah, we'll keep this topped up, I think. Yeah, we're going to time lapse this. Another one while we've got a minute. Yeah, it's going to take probably all of this, I'd say. Yeah, it is. And more. I would like to get us a bigger trailer. I really would. But I'm not sure about the tr the 70 tonner that I normally get. This seems a... Yeah... I think something like a 40 tonner seems to sit the the roads going through the village on this are very very um, yeah they are very narrow as we found a, quite a few times so to play in harmony with the map the street size I think is probably the way we should actually go ah so that is yeah this is really oh, that's enough for two 20 tonners. Yeah, we'll have a look, I think. Uh, in fact, the um, the trailer we've got with the is has also... Sorry, I will talk in complete... I do talk in riddles sometimes. That trailer over there, the liquid one, also comes with one that you can have a normal trailer. And I think that's a 37 tonner as well. That's not far off, because it's not a bad size tr framework. That isn't about right for this map, I would say. We shall have a look. Yeah, we shall. And it's a fixed frame, it's not swivel axle. I do like that. Ooh. I think we ought to change that to left. I think it's, yeah, it might be in the catchment area, but it's a little... How are we looking at that? Yeah, smashing. Speed time up, actually. Let's do it at 360. That might well keep going, because it's going to be draining quicker than that's 
Now that animation's... Oh no, it is going down. Yeah, just very slowly. Mind you, it is a slow release. I was, uh, it is still moving the tray, though. Uh, you see, this is why I stopped using them. This wonder. Especially when it was used as a bale trailer. Yeah, so it, it's better. It isn't as terrible as it was. I think I could put up with this. It was awful as a bale trailer, though. If you were trying to put bales on a moving trailer, that is the main reason I stopped doing this on the old stream farm. I had this for a while, but... Right. Let's go and fill that again. Let's knock that down to one. That's needing filling again, yeah. It overtook us. Yes, I think, like on a few of the Let's Plays, this one, we've got a 300 horsepower tractor. I suppose, you know, for this Let's Play, do we need anything bigger than that? With the field sizes we've got, do we need a beast? I suppose if we were going to try to incorporate monstrous plows, we would, but unless we are going to do that... Oh, wow, I'd forgotten about the fact it processes it as well, so... That's the point. How much... We got in the all 246 tons of grass. Yeah, that's going to last a while. That's gonna, that's two two and a bit days of processing. 120 tons a day that processes. So that's two and a bit days. So October, November, and a little bit of December. But yes, I do seriously think we do need one bigger one. I know we'd still be doing this in two hits, but this this we do in three, so let's have a quick look while we are doing that at the trailers and see if there's anything else. It's also size. Yeah, it really is. Let's have a look. I don't mind, yes, but the Brantners are quite good at 33, 34, 29, 37, but they are the Flegals are expensive. Even though, yeah. Relatively 37.5, the Agriliner. That's also equally. That's 40 meters. 40, cu 40 tons. That's big, that is. Yeah, that must be quite tall to do that. And I don't mind tall. Is that a push as well? The farm tech. It's not a swivel axle. Or is it a lift? It's hard to say. I think it must be a push. That looks fixed at the front. That would be quite good. It is expensive, but yeah. Let's have a look. 47. That looks equally... Oh. Yeah, that's nice and tall. Let's go back one. It's not always. It's just silage. Oh, that's everything, but that isn't. Let's have a look at yeah the Aperion. I do like the Aperion, but that is just very long. But yeah, I, don't, I think that's when it's getting a bit silly for this map. Yeah, some of these down this end. Yeah, now they're small. No Adjuranti. Now you see that swivel axle. Ah, shame that is because it's very reasonable does it matter though that swivel axle we're not going to be dragging one of them let's just try the other one we've got yeah the that's 29 20 yeah these ones here if we go for tipper body standard how big is that it is 34.7 it's a little bit under it's actually very long yeah it is actually so I think we're going to need to spend that's again swivel axle or I might actually go for that I wanted to incorporate that into a few let's plays but oh now these are new yeah they are but they're not big enough yeah the Mets Metso the Faz if we'd got a lorry it's it's yeah it isn't long it is long but it's not massively so I think that's it. I think they're all. Oh. That's a point. Now these are like a strong tractor, even though it doesn't give you an amount. I've got this on the um, oh, 
you know, my weird brain's gone. Yeah, although it doesn't say it has got a limit, it really does like quite a powerful tractor. So, and I mean, the 250 horsepower I've got on that Let's Play, and it still struggles a little bit with it. Yeah, these are long. I do like it. So I think then, all things considered, over the winter, I'm not going to do it now, I think we are going to go for, it was, no, oh you're the beat cutter, ah, who was one, yeah, I've got to be honest, yeah, Let's have a look. You do carry anything, and you're 45 tons. That is quite impressive. I th yeah, I know it is. I did really want one that was not swivel axle. Let's have a look. There was another one as well. Let's go down a little. No, Load King. Farm Tech. Yeah. Radium, that was only, yeah, it was. It's forage type, isn't it? So there's that one. It's a little bit longer, though. I like the Adjuranti. Now I've got to give the Adjuranti a... And it's very reasonable. I think we will indeed buy that. Right, we're going to go and get that. Yeah, these... These are still useful, always for sticking at the side of the fields. I don't sort of feel bad that we've got these as well. No, I think these are... Let's go grab that. Shall we top up fuel as we go in? We'll go and grab that. I think this is... Yeah, this is going to be the end of the session, though, truthfully. This has been quite a monster. We've done all the field work, though. I'm well chuffed. That's grass. I'd like to take it through to tomorrow, though, just to see the grass in the field. I think I missed a patch. I'm sure I did. I did see one little... Yeah, bit that I had missed. Now nah, let's just also check that we've done all of the rolling. Let's have a look on the map. I think we did, but let's... Yeah, yeah. obviously with the rolling where the cows are, it hasn't been done because we can't do that. Right. Let's just top up. We don't need it, need, but yeah. The torpedo that I keep calling the rocket is quite happy over there. It's not hurting. to crash into the wall yeah this is the nasty bit in th going through the village that the bigger things they sort of go onto the actual walkway so you take most of the thing it's yeah it's a bit of a we've seen it with the harvesters so right hope this is the right thing to choose not had the Adjuranti in this for a long time. It used to be a lot dearer to actually have it in this configuration on FS19. This was one of my firm favourites. I used to have this, the auto load for nearly all. That is good. It is. It's tall. I can cope with that. Yes, I've not tried it in this configuration in FS22. So, in fact, yeah, it's not been out as, as long as there. This used to be my when I did autoload in FS19, which I don't want to go back to, I want to stay as, yeah, realistic. Semi-automatic is the most I'm going to go to, otherwise I'll be manually bailing, manually loading, bailing. <laughs> we'll get the words right. Right. Let's grab... Nah, actually, that's the point. We'll do this, we'll go to the morning and we'll literally top up. I think that's where we'll leave it. So we shall sleep, and we shall see the grass over the road. Put this underneath the silage nozzle. And we'll get this, and we'll be on third growth stage. 
Do we cut the grass tomorrow one last time? No, we know for once we're going to leave it. We've got plenty in for over the winter. We'll do a fresh cut early next year so we don't muck around with that. That's the point. Yeah, I am forgetting that I've actually got two with the uh, grass and straw in. I think this is the one with the least in though. Which have we got in this one? Ooh. 240 tons oh, yeah that's two days as well so we are going to be well chocker with so this this trail has come in in the nick of time yeah I didn't expect that we would be having the Adirante I was thinking it would be one of the others but I do like the shape of this one I think it's I don't think we've got any silage ready in this we should try though oh he was saying. <laughs> oh, well. Yeah, I have been known to be wrong quite frequently. As I'm sure you were fully aware. Yeah, this this would definitely be better for... Um, now then, I think this is back tip only, looking at that. And is this a push or is it a tip? I, can't, I think it's a tip, isn't it? Yeah, my least favourite sports. It's perfect in every other way. You cannot have everything. Well, you can sometimes, but very, very not very often. Yeah, I've got a lot of fond memories of this Let's Play. I remember the first few sessions. Boy, was this. Oh, it was. Yeah. All of the cultivating to make. We have come a long way. That's something I definitely remember very fondly. Right, there's a bit of a top up on this as well. Let's do that quickly. We shall see. It is a tip. I thought it would be. In fact, let's speed time up. Let's do a 360. We'll get all of this in tonight. With that, it should pretty much keep a, a pace or slightly beat us. The uh, take this till about six. Switch the lights on, and then we should refill this ready for the morning. Right, let's do this till about five. And then we should f refill till morning. That should pretty much, yeah, maybe. Be a little bit under. Wow, the hourly tick up on this is amazing. We've just bought this and it's gone up to above the amount we had before. Silage, digestate 34 tons. So we're saving that until December, January, till the highest point. Yeah, good business. What's that two kilogram 96% thing about? What on earth? I don't get that. slow on load rates, I think. Or is it because there was a lot? I'm not sure, maybe. What? Is that a silage additive? Well, I've not put anything in this. What on earth is that? Oh, I love the trailer noise. Amazing. Right, let's fill this up ready for morning. In fact, I think there's a torch that we need to be doing now. sleep through till morning I think nine o'clock this time of year I think it's getting that winded down somewhat we should check the sales we shall my favorite time of the day to play. 
Bonanza. That's not a bad idea. Ah, oh, the the phoenix is following me everywhere. No, no, I'm not going to, not for once, but that, I am tempted, we, yeah. Well, we've got to go a li do a little bit better on our, it's the 9 metre, isn't it? It's about perfect for this map, and it fertilises as well, so do you know something? I say yes, indeed. I know it's not, it isn't no-till, I do know that, but, yeah, it's still... Yeah, the Phoenix is on nearly every special offer on every single Let's Play I'm going on. I bought this, the Phoenix, on so many Let's Plays recently, and it's on this one as well. I would like to, yeah, not... Oh, that's growing nicely. Let's go and see the grass. We'll just st start this tipping, and we'll manage the right lights. So they can go off now. Yeah, we'll do two of these, but while this is unloading... We shall pop and see the grass. Smashing. Yeah, I think there's a bit of a patch somewhere. I think it's, oh, there's one there as well. Oh no, that's just a wheel mark. That's not too bad. Yeah, I think there's a tiny twitch in the corner. I didn't quite get it. I was trying a few times. I thought, oh, it's, it's not going to matter, but it is. I, I hate leaving bits like that. Yeah, it was down here. I'm sure there's one tiny bit that I didn't actually catch with the cedar. I'm sure there was. Okay. No. If so, I can't see it. Is it? No, that's stone. Oh, okay. Well, there you go. Smashing. I hate bits of a grass field that aren't sort of done. So, smashing. That's all done here. So. We will do a fence, but we'll do that next year when we're ready to place the uh, shed. Right, so how are we doing? We'll do another one. That's going to be about right. Wow. It is very slow. Yeah, it is. I expected in that time for that to definitely have been done. But hey ho. Digest 8 is up to 53 tons. Smashing. Yeah, that is a little bit slow. I think, me personally, I think that is a, yeah, it's coming out very slowly. Oh well, it's, yeah, you can't have it because it's tall. Perhaps it's, yeah. We may go for a lorry and a lorry back. <laughs> we might go for the Nifaz on this map, because I think to go bigger than that 48 tonne might be a bit... Yeah, but I would like a lorry, I think, for tazzing around and doing the bigger jobs. I just don't want a massive, massive... Yeah, what I'm thinking of is this particular... truck, which is... Well, that's right, there's the cab over, isn't there? I never thought, I'd forgotten about that. These are big, though. And that's not, yeah, that's a short body. It's no different to any other. Yeah, that's true. Why are my options saying. 120,000 when I, it doesn't say anything at all on any of those options. Okay. Interesting. Now there is that actually. Would that suit us on this map? It doesn't need to be. That's, that is true. You've also got the. Yeah, the, that. And then they've also got the trailer hitch at the back. Oh, that takes me back to as a kid, that does. I think we will. Because right, that's sometimes it's going to just suit us as it is. But obviously we don't know what a lorry back. That will tow... That's true, that will do the Adjurante as well. Which would mean it was... 
45, 55, 60 tons each time. That would actually do in a single hit. I'll just think about that. That's the one I was going to go for. But that's a proper lorry. And it is smaller. It's not massively massive. Oh, of course, the Mac. Let's see those normal on a British map, though. That is, the, that is the thing it is. You might see a man. Yeah, I think we might go for the Fiat, if I'm honest. Right. Stick another load in, and we'll just do this, and then that is where we are going to leave things. Yeah, it's been a good session. Grass has grown across the road. Did I shut the gate? That is the question. These should both be well up now. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go and see how much silage is in this one. This should be 150, 80 tons, because of course we did it quite late, didn't we? So. Yes, I think the Fiat, I think it would suit us on this. It's it's not a massive thing. It's still reasonably fast. 60 kph, which I believe is that. For, is that 60 kph, isn't that? 40 odd miles an hour. Which is, is, yeah, it's not as fast as I'd like it to be for a lorry, but... It's got its tip of body as well as the fact it can take a trailer. So, it would, yeah, I think that's... If, there's always trade-offs, there's got to be compromises, especially on a map like this where realistically the British roads are not like the American ones, yeah. Right. Right, that's what we're going to do, we'll leave that. So, that's, I'm quite chuffed, it's only October, yes I know the grass is, we could technically cut this, but if we do, the next year it will start being very, very low. It will be bold and we'll have to wait. So if we do this, I'm, I'm sure this dies down one growth stage, but it means in March it's it's grown, is it, or is it April more than it's full? But if we cut it and it's zero growth, then it really will only be one growth stage. You've got to wait two or three months to cut it. So I'd sooner cut it early by not cutting it now. So we've got a lot of silage to do over the winter. We've got decisions to make. We have, yeah, the farmyard to finish or even start over here. It would be nice to put proper roots down and actually design a proper well. If anyone's got any suggestions for sheds, yeah, I don't mind it being expensive. We are beginning to get to the point where we've got quite a lot of, we will have quite a lot of money on hand over the winter with all of those, the grass and straw that's going to be converted. I think there's going to be 500 odd tonnes. Let's not guess. Let's have a look in the two productions and see how much. 150, 230, and 250. So yeah, it was not far off actually. About nearly 500 tons to process. Right, how are you doing? Nearly there. Last bit. Yeah, in fact, that's yeah, that's as much as we can do for now. And that is where we're going to leave things. Yeah, we shall process this. I think we're completely done. So next time it is a matter of cycling through the winter, getting our silage. Should we make this a bit easier? On let's go and get the... Yeah, I think actually that's... Let's do the Fiat now. We can afford it. Yeah, we'll go grab that. That is a pin hitch, so that's perfect. Let's go visit in. We should catch the bus up to the shop. And we shall buy from the shop. We should call in the office in Taylor's Agricultural Engineers and we shall order our lorry. We shall. One that suits the map, I think. Definitely the old Fiat. Let's say it is a tad slower. I would have preferred that. That's a real beast. You know. Don't settle. If you want it, go for it. We, I've wanted this for ages, actually, so. Cheat. Oh, okay. No, we'll go for I'm not. I'm quite happy with. Oh, they look nice. Oh, 
but then they're nice as well. Don't, I'm not keen on the colour. I like the red. I've seen this before. I did actually look at this. I think it looks really nice. So do you know something? We're not going to settle. And it has got a hitch. It's one of the few lorries that has a hitch at the back. So we will buy it. Right. Let's take our maiden voyage. That's not that has seriously knocked us down. But hey ho. That's a point. No, it's three point hitch, isn't it? I don't know why you're even bothering you know it's a 3 point edge. Yeah, we'll come and grab that in a bit. Not today. Yeah. We've planted all that we've got to plant this year, so. Yeah, it's is still not massively massive, not like a Mac or something like that, which on British roads would be a bit of overkill, or even the Phoenix, really. On this, these thin roads here, you can see that's really as big as we can go. I don't know that the Max are any wider actually, but yeah. We wouldn't see them on this. This could be a European import, so it's more believable. You'd mainly see Mans, really, I would say, and that type. Yeah, you don't see many American trucks on the uh, roads in Britain. In fact, I can't think that I've ever seen one in my life. Possibly. It's definitely rare. Right, that's annoying me. Let's yeah. Let's just use the smoothing tool. Fantastic. So useful. Right, now then let's just make sure. The, obviously the advantage of the Fiat was the fact that it obviously could Yeah. Could have a lorry back as well as brilliant. Excellent. Smashing. Yeah, so that's. But why settle? Right, that's it. Yeah, we have seriously dinted our thing, but again, it's growth. We have bought more equipment. Yeah, we have a new trailer. The Adjurante. A little bit slow on the. Well, no, but it's about perfect for the size of the map. And we have a new lorry. Yeah, and, a, and a, a right size lorry for the map, I think. It's not a monster, it really isn't. Well, I don't think it would suit this Let's Play, if I'm honest. Right, so that is where we're going to leave things. Yeah, I hope you're going to continue with me on this Let's Play. Any suggestions, sheds, or anything else? Oh, we've got a ton of it flickering in the back, but that's not bad. I've seen a lot worse. Yes, please, any comments, suggestions, things you'd like to do? I say, I think we're going to definitely, I think we're going to do sugar beets next year because you can actually put sugar beets in this you can yes I think that would be a decent thing it'll help us on our our um, empire <laughs> our energy business as well anyway yes I am going to say goodbye for now